Hey everybody, we're going to take a look at 678 Union Avenue. This is a legal two-family brick house uh, with a basement as well. We're actually going to start in the basement unit and then make our way upstairs. All right, let's go ahead and take a look at the basement apartment. It is walk out from the front of the house as well as the back of the house. There's a backyard. As we come in, uh, you see the ceramic tiles on the floor. There is this access to the uh, first floor or there's access from the first floor to the basement from inside the house, as you can see here. Uh, let's go ahead and take a look. We have our two gas meters here. We have a front window, recessed lights throughout. Uh, it's about six and a half foot ceilings. Uh, immediately we have our uh, kitchen with a sink, stove, and a, a laundry machine. All right, and then there's a little bit of a space here for a uh, dining table. As we walk our walk further, we have our storage under the um, staircase that we just saw. Then we have our laundry, uh, sorry, our, our utilities room. We have two sets of boilers, and then we have a two sets of hot water tanks. There we go, got some light in here. All right, so we have two separate boilers for up, for the two units upstairs, and then we also have two hot water tanks, each unit with its own one. All right, as we continue further down the hallway, it's a wide hallway, it's about five, six foot, uh, foot uh, wide hallway. Then we have a, a full bathroom on the left with a tub and a toilet and a sink. Continuing forward, we have our uh, living room. Again, recessed lights. We have a full-size window with some natural light coming in. And then we have a uh, continuing up with the hallway. And then we have this common space here as well. Again, with a full-size window. We have one more little space here with a window. And then we have an exterior door here. So let's go ahead and take a look outside. All right, so as we open that exterior door, it puts us in this space here. It's got an outlet. It's a little a storage unit, storage space here. And then we have a beautiful, quiet, shaded, cozy backyard with a nice tree and stairs, step, steps going up to the first floor, which we will take a look at from here. All right, so let's go ahead and take a look. So that's that. We will look at that apartment in a second. Let's go upstairs from the front of the house. But before we do that, let's just look at the side of the house here. Very good. Let's work our way inside. All right, so we're in 678 Union Avenue. Now we're going to look at the first floor apartment. As soon as we enter through the main door, we have our beautiful apartment right here on the first floor. So let's go ahead and take a look. The first thing you notice is the beautiful hardwood floor, nice and shiny, clean. And just look at the open floor plan. Plenty of uh, space to sprawl out. You've got these three windows in the front bringing you plenty of natural light. And then you have enough room to put all of your furniture and TV and everything else that you want to do. Your book, uh, books and so forth. All right, your shoes. Take a look. Um, so wonderful apartment. Kept really nice and clean. It's a it's a modern open floor plan between kitchen, dining, and living space. You've got this beautiful uh, stone counter in the middle. Uh, plenty of cabinets, stainless steel appliances, refrigerator, dishwasher, and a stove with a microwave above. All right, you've got high ceilings and recessed light. Uh, this door would go down to the basement apartment that we just saw. Uh, it is kept closed for the moment, but that's where it, it's located on this floor. You've got your electric panel for this floor right here. So each floor has its own electric panel. Continuing down the hallway, again, you need to notice the same beautiful hardwood floors. We have our first bedroom. It's 
spacious enough for you to put a, a full or a queen size bed. You've got a window here bringing you light and air and you've got a double door closet. Let's move on to down the hallway. You have this amazing bathroom with a walk-in shower and your sink and then your toilet is right behind. You've got that beautiful accent wall and it's everything is just sparkling clean. And then we have our second bedroom for this apartment. Again, nice and tidy, two windows, double door closet, beautiful hardwood floors, and not to mention your own balcony, which I showed you from the other side of the house, but here it is one more time. All right, so you've got your own nice little private space with this beautiful green tree, giving you a bit of nature in the middle of the city so now let's go ahead and take a look at the upstairs unit and wrap up this wrap up this tour all right so we're going to make our way back out of the apartment on this floor and giving you one final look for the first floor all right so let's go back in and this time we're going to go tour the top apartment all right so again this is the first floor apartment that we just saw and now we're going to go ahead and take a look at the second floor duplex all right so again those same hardwood floors that we saw downstairs you have those beautiful hardwood floors again the same open floor floor plan that you have here This is the look back. You've got a open concept between living, dining, and kitchen. You've got those white cabinets, stainless steel appliances. You've got those three windows in the front. You've got that electric panel on this floor, as I mentioned. And then you've got the high ceilings here as well with recessed lights uh, and much of, the, much of the apartment. All right, down the hallway, we have our bathroom. So we have our uh, tub and toilet and sink. And then we have our closet here. This is actually a laundry closet. Uh, so you would need to put a stackable unit if you wanted to. And then continuing forward, we have our first bedroom for this apartment. This uh, bedroom has a access to its own balcony. So. This is a great property. The basement apartment had its own access to the backyard. The first floor had a balcony and the second floor also has a balcony. I mean, can it get any better than this? All right, here's a view of that yard from all the way to the top. And then here's a look back. You've got a French door on the balcony. And then you have a closet with the light in this room. Let's go ahead and look at room number two. This is one of the smaller rooms. This is the smallest room in the house. Uh, big enough for a twin bed. It's got a large window. And then it too has a closet. All right. Here's a look back at the, at the room. Now, let's go ahead and make our way to the top floor. This is a duplex, so the master bedroom is yet to be seen. All right, beautiful stairs. As we get up here, we have our master bedroom. This is bigger than the two rooms downstairs, big enough for a full, a queen, a king. Uh, you have a window there, you also have a window here, and then you have a closet here, and then you also have a closet here, with a light and an exhaust fan when it gets hot. And then maybe a little work desk could go here, way near the window to look outside and enjoy the scenery. All right, so that's, take a, that's a look at 678 Union Avenue in the Bronx. Legal two-family with a full basement. 
Uh, asking price is 920-920. Three bedrooms over two bedrooms over a sort of a one bedroom or a studio apartment in the basement. Reach out to arrange a showing. Thank you.